So in this video, we're gonna take a look at the Treb Lab Z7 Pro Hybrid ANC headphones. I wanna thank the guys at Treb Lab for sending these over to review on the channel. Regular price is 155 bucks, but currently there's a coupon for $17 off. I'll leave a link in the description of the video with current pricing and more information some of the top features, six built-in microphones, transparent mode. They're advertising 45 hours playtime. These also have touch control and on-ear detection. These also have quick charge where 20 minutes is gonna give you up to five hours use. These have 40 millimeter drivers. These also have Bluetooth 5.0, aptX, HD, IPX4 water resistant. And it's also gonna work with Siri or Google Assistant. It's got a nice little travel case here. Also comes with a 3.5 millimeter audio cable. Okay, yeah, these are definitely nice quality. Nice leather up material there on the headband. Nice leather up material on the ear cushions. Feels like a super soft memory foam cushion. Nice thing is the ear cups on these fold flat. There on the right ear cup, you've got your ANC button, power and Bluetooth pairing button. You've also got your headphone jack. As you can see, these are sort of a matte gray color. USB-C charging port there in the left ear cup. Pretty typical metal adjustable sliders. Overall, just really nice quality. From the side angle, you can see just how thick the ear cushions are. Let's go ahead and see how hard these are to connect to my phone. Okay, seems to connect pretty easily. You've got a leather up material on the outside of the ear cups. That's where your touch controls are. I'm gonna go ahead and test these out for a while. I'll also give you a mic test so you can see what that sounds like and give you my first impressions of the Z7 Pro by Treb Lab. So this is a mic test for the Treb Lab Z7 Pro wireless ANC headphones. I gotta say, these are very comfortable, even for long periods of time. After a while, my ears do get a little warm, but overall, not too bad. They also fit pretty much completely over top of my ears, which is definitely a must, in my opinion, for any headphones. They're really easy to connect, and the Bluetooth signal seems pretty stable as well. I didn't have any issues connecting or keeping them paired with my phone or PC. I noticed they also stop playing audio when you take these off of your head, which is definitely another nice feature to have. You also get pretty good bass with these when listening to music, sound clear is good on these and that's with the ANC turned on or off. These are fairly lightweight and really don't have much pressure on the top or sides of my head. To me I feel like these are a really good option if you're looking for high quality ANC headphones and style wise these even look like something from Sony but are quite a bit cheaper. The noise cancelling feature on these headphones actually work really good as well. They seem to block out just about all surrounding sounds. You can still hear people talk but you're not going to hear fan noise or anything like that that's fairly close to you. The touch controls do take a little bit of getting used to, but functionality wise actually works pretty good once you're used to them. So my first impressions, yeah, you definitely got to check these out. So if you've made it this far into the video, you may want to say thanks by subscribing and don't forget to give a thumbs up if this video was helpful. This is Brian from Fishbee Productions. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm.